CT News app. Hauled away illegally. Now the man who did it is facing charges. That man is David Eason, the husband of MTV's Teen Mom star 2, Janelle Evans. He posted this video on YouTube, which shows him pulling a truck out of its parking space in downtown Wilmington in July. Now the owner of that truck now pressing charges, saying the illegal tow damaged his transmission. WECT's Ben Smart has been following this story all day. Ben, first, Wilmington police said they weren't filing charges. Now they are filing charges. Yeah, friend, I'm here at the New Andover County Sheriff's Department where right outside this is the white truck that you're about to see in a video. It's Terry Hill's truck. The 73 year old is inside right now speaking with the police and magistrate. Uh, he says enough is enough. Someone has to hold David Eason accountable. The MTV's Teen Mom 2 former star uh, has a controversial history. He was fired from the show after posting homophobic tweets. Earlier today, the Wilmington Police Department released a statement. They said that Hill would not file charges against Eason, but I reached out to Hill. He says he actually told police he would think about it. This afternoon, he made up his mind to press charges against Eason for the damage to his truck, including damage to the bumper, mirror, transmission, and engine. The truck was towed forcefully, as you can see in this video, while still in park. We followed Hill as he went to the Wilmington Police Department and New Hanover County Sheriff's Department today to go through the process of filing those charges. He says uh, he had to take time off from work in order to do this, but he says it's worth it to hold him accountable. Take a listen. Well, I went home last night and I was talking to my wife and she says somebody has to stop this guy. All the views that we talked to on her computer, People said, y'all need to press charges. You need to press charges. And so I decided I would. It's going to be worth it. And Hill again is inside right now with the magistrate and police officer working to fill out that paperwork to file charges. Now, after our first story post was posted, Janelle Evans and uh, David Easton fired back on Facebook. They called WECT fake news and questioned whether uh, Terry was actually in need of a handicap sign on his truck. Uh, Terry says that he has worked in construction since he was 19 and has a bad back, bad legs, uh, and is really needing that in order to get through his daily life. For now, we're reporting live in Wilmington. Ben Smart, back to you.